What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Ari. Welcome back to AM I'll Advice, your, your favorite fat, smiling kid. You know, I'm the fat kid on the block that everybody just loves. I don't know why, but I don't have snacks. But if you guys are new to the channel, smash that like button. Thank you for all the love you guys have been showing me. I mean, it's so tremendous. I just love you guys, just the way you guys be loving me. I love you back, man. Here's a hug. Come. Ugh, I'm hugging you guys. But if you guys are new to the channel, that's a welcome hug, all right? Thank you and welcome to the family, you know, AM Island Vibes, the only YouTube channels where I'm on, <laughs> you know, you know, but we're just trying to work on this. But today we're going to be reacting to five YouTubers who forget to stop recording. Trust me. I understand. I understand, you know, but we're going to get into it. I'm going to tell you the time, my, my story at the end of the video when I forgot to stop recording. Okay. Stay tuned for that. It's very funny. Trust me. Alright, but let's get into the video. Like this video right now or this spider will crawl on you when you're next sleeping. Ah. Hey guys and welcome back to Flex Trends. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at five YouTubers who forgot that they were live or just some terrible editing mistakes. Be sure to watch the full video because you'll be seeing people like Funny Mike, CJ So Cool and more. So guys, believe me, you don't want to miss out on any of these. Number 1. CJ So Cool In at number 1 on today's list of insanely shocking YouTube and Twitch moments is CJ So Cool. Now, just a few years ago, CJ was live streaming when him and his girl began play fighting. However, many eagle-eyed viewers seem to think that CJ may have overstepped the mark just a little, with some fans suggesting that he actually choked his girl and hurt her. So, let's check out the clip. Baby, come here, come help me! Where's my shoes, bro? <laughs> Where's my shoes? Where's my shoes, bro? I'm not playing with you! Where's my shoes? It's a what? It's a freebie! Where's my shoes, bro? Where's my shoes, bro? I'm not playing with you! Where's my shoes? How is he a prank, bro? Where's my shoes at? Where did you put my shoes at? It's, it's the same. Where did you put my shoes at? Back up, bruh. Where's your shoes at? Baby, it's a prank. What the? What is this? Where's my shoes? Oh my gosh. Baby, calm down. Calm down. Come on. I don't think you really like, did that. Where's my shoes, bro? <laughs> That's all your shoes. No, it's not. Camera out of my face. Where's my shoes? I don't think he really did it, man. Baby, you really took it that far. You think this is true? I think that's his cap. My yeah. shoe? Number two. Funny I think Mike. it's cap. Next up on our cap. list is Funny Mike, who earlier this year went live to his many fans on Instagram. I think the it's YouTuber cap. was simply clearing out his closet I'll give him when he walked into the, the bedroom. I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. Oh, God. Got this girl there. And, well, let's just say things got a little, well, frisky. He couldn't resist, could he? Let's check it out. But be sure to stay tuned, because coming up we have clips from the likes of Pretty Boy Fredo. Mm. Mm. Yes. Mm. Oh God! Hey! Oh shit! Stop stepping my teeth! Why you stop? Man, stop stepping your mother teeth, man! What's in your teeth, bro? Stop rolling the fuck on my teeth! Bro, come on! This ain't true. Oh my god. 
Can I see you crying with all the tears? Pretty boy Fredo. That's cap. That's cap. Number three, we have Pretty Boy Fredo. We measured that really happened. NBA 2K20. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It would be while streaming that very game, the young star got caught with his trousers round his ankles in what you could say would be every guy's worst nightmare. Oh the man, come on. The whole episode was live streamed to thousands of viewers. However, he has since claimed that it was simply a prank. But we'll let you decide. Oh god. That ain't real. And we want to pay this clip the Pause. Any real man know that ain't real. Listen, fellas, I don't know if it's only me, but fellas, you. Alright, we, we're men. We're men, right? We're men. Let's be honest. Bye, yo. You, you tell me. Alright, no moment. Alright, let me just get it up. If you're going to masturbate as a guy, you wouldn't just. If you, if you think you by yourself, man, that shit, your pants are going down. You pull your pants down lower than that. No, no homo, no homo, no homo. I'm just saying from experience, you know what I mean? Like, be honest. If you freaking slang and dang a last, you know, it's a peanut, you know, no, no, you know, I just saying, you know, maybe that's a, you know? So you, you know, if you ain't shy, you pull that, and you just put down to at least your knee. Or pass your thighs, and you just do what you gotta do. You mean this? Or you know what I mean? Like that's you want to be comfortable when you're doing something like that, you know. And another thing is, I can tell by his shoulders. His shoulders too tight. It's too tight. His shoulders like this. You know what I mean? If you doing that, listen to me. Your shoulders gonna be done, and you just could be freaking. You know, see, your shoulders ain't gonna be tight. You could be loose. You can see in his face he's too tight and it's a prank. I feel like it's a prank. I feel like Pray Fredo don't want it's a prank. Prank. You know, I guess you can see in his face he's too tight. So you're gonna be like this. And when you're doing it, like <laughs> Alright, just know it's a prank. Alright, let's get back to it. All respect it deserves. Earlier this summer, Angel Walk was streaming when loud screams of distress could be heard in the background, followed by panic back banks at his door. Angel ran to assist his family with whatever it was that was causing alarm, before then returning to sadly tell his street that his brother had died. Now, I'll warn you guys, this clip is extremely distressing, and Aww. our thoughts and prayers go out to Angel and his family at this very tough time. I don't even want to comment on it. I'm it's just anime, so funny that we couldn't resist Sorry for the lag, man. Sorry. Fearsome Mike is a Minecraft YouTuber who left college to pursue his dream of making it online. One day, the young creator was given a huge donation of $5,000. Naturally, he decided to call his mother and tell her the good news. Excited about potentially investing the money into a car. But things didn't go to plan. Let's just say that his mother didn't match his excitement oh. in any way, shape or form. Well, here's the clip. 
Just a quick note before I show this clip. Guys, if you are passionate about something and you want to do it for a living, who cares what anyone thinks? If you facts. love doing it, then go Big for facts. it. Anyways, here's the clip. I encourage everybody. Hello, Mom. Yeah? I just got a $5,000 donation on my stream. What? I just got a $5,000 donation on my live stream. Somebody gave me $5,000. I can get a car now. Okay. I know. Are you proud of me? Are you happy that I that I didn't go to college? I don't care. Goodbye. I think she was just a little bit stressed out, guys. Huh. Mom sounds like a bitch. Facts. And you can see in his face. <laughs> don't cry, bro. I honestly don't even laugh, bro. I'm even fucking funny. Oh my gosh, ads! Stop playing with me. Hey, guys, I'm trying to make some freaking ads off me. What? what? I don't. You know, I don't need the support of my mom. Honestly, no, I don't need her anymore. I, I, I don't. I don't need her. You anymore. don't. She, she, guys, let's be real here. I don't. I don't. I don't need her. So, if you made it to this part, then you're right, bro. No disrespect to to your mother. If you, if you guys, you know, it's not my business to speak on anywhere from the sounds of it. Like he said, your mother sounds like a bitch. And I try to stop cursing, but that's just fucked up, bro. You know what I mean? And you know what would be crazy? It's be your own family who do it to you. Your own family. The people who are supposed to be there support you and you know what I mean? All your good stuff. But it's the one who's hating you more than anybody sometimes. You know? But don't worry, kid. You're going to get it. With the mindset you just said and you have, you don't need her support. You going you gonna get it. it. It hurt. I can see it in your face and hurt. Of course, that would hurt anybody, you know. But at the end of the day, you're still a man. And I respect you for that. Leo, I just want to say thank you so much. Yeah. I hope you're all doing well and keeping safe. And apart from that, I'll see you on the next one. Yes, Bye. Sir. You know, like that that that, that touched me because like, bro. That's messed up. I call you to share what what happened to me, and you just tell me you don't care. No matter if you had a bad day, rough day, you don't you don't tell your ch your, your child that. You hear it in his voice, he excited about something. He accomplished something he probably never accomplished before. Like he just said, he can buy a car. You should be like, hey, sweetie, I'm happy for you, man. You you want you got you you can finally get your ride. You can finally you know what I mean. But. Hey, all my small, my other small YouTubers, Twitch streamers, all everybody, all the small guys, you don't need the support of anybody to help you, to motivate you, motivate yourself, be your own, be your own fan first, trust me, all right? The road is going to get a lot harder before it gets easier, and when you become successful, they can come asking you for help, money, this, yada, yada, this, yada, the same free, oh, all you do is sit on your ass all day and play a game, you know, they get... You can remember that. And when they come back and be like, yeah, but this playing game all day helped me get this bag. Now you want some of it? Now nah, you didn't support it. You know, and I just want to take this time up to say thank you to my father who who been a real supporter. He don't understand. I, I can see it and say sometimes he don't understand what I be talking about, but it don't matter. That don't matter to me. Once he's willing to sit down and listen to what I have to say, and he be like, hey, his favorite word is, hey, if you think it makes sense, do it. You never know. That's his favorite word. You never know. And I respect it because you never know. You never know if you don't try. That's the whole point. You know? Rather you fail trying than to never try. You know what I mean? To be comfortable and never try. And I just want to appreciate him for that. And say thank you. You know? But hope you guys enjoyed the video. Smash that like button. Subscribe. All that good stuff. Oh! I told you guys I was going to tell you my story. This is what I realized. I talk a lot to myself. I was sitting down here. Like my table's right in front of me. I sit down this whole time on my phone, talking to myself, eating food, recording. You would swear to somebody sitting down next to me. I ran in big conversation with myself. You could tell I, I grew up a lonely child, which I did. I never really had much friends growing up. And I was always by myself when I was growing up, you know. I just danced inside the house, so I was my always, I was my only friend and my always was my friend, so I always depend on me, you know what I mean? But 
That's just a little something. It wasn't nothing hilarious, you know? Nothing like them other guys. But, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Smash that like button, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff down below in the comment section if you guys are new to the channel. And until we meet again, remember the world is yours. Peace.